Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Um, I know that the box would usually be here, but I just have to do this little intro thing. Uh, first of all, I want to say sorry for not uploading this video um, for a while. I made my video earlier saying, do you want an unboxing first or do you want the aircraft to just be in the next video and I'll just uh, show it to you. Um, but I got... <laughs> One comment saying to do an unboxing, so here I am gonna do an unboxing of um, a BA seven eight seven dash eight. Um, this might be my last video for a while, um, so um, or I might have another one, so I might upload two more videos, um, but the second one won't be like this, um. Uh, also, if you're wondering why not have a box for the intro, it's because um, on the camera, the angle, it won't get the entire box. And I thought that view was better. Anyway, that's enough That's enough of that. Um, let's just get on to the um, model. Uh, so I'm just going to um, get put the camera there. Okay, so I have the box here. And here we go. The uh, BA787 dash eight I've had this for a while actually um, I just never got to do um, an unboxing um, so in this box it has this information here so if you do want to read that do you just pause the video um, some information about the aircraft and a bit about the airline um, so yeah, um, I'll actually be flying on this aircraft soon, um, so I'm excited for that. So I'm just going to position the air, the model phone, so I can show you the aircraft. Sorry about that, this is okay. Now for the aircraft, I, before I do start, I just want to say this is my favourite, uh, model, um, I guess you could say one two hundred models. I can from I probably can decide of uh, decide between this model and the uh, BA seven four seven, um, but it's probably one of my favorites. So uh, so here's the actual model. Um, I I just it's such a good model, and so when so the uh, well, the shop where I bought this from like the uh, guy working there he said. Uh, just take a look, see if you like it, see if you're sure. Uh, so I did. Honestly, I'm not too fussy about the models. Um, except, and I'm not really that mad. I mean, when I looked at it, I didn't realise this until I actually had it home. That there's a chip on the winglet there. There's no, um, like there's a piece chipped off, but honestly not that annoying because it's barely noticeable. But anyways, uh, here we have the cockpit, and above the cockpit it says BGC, um, or um, I think it's Bravo Juliet, I forgot what the next one is, I think it's going to be like Charlotte, I don't know, I don't know the exact, like, um, you know, the alphabet, like, how they say it, but I know some of it, um, hatch over the cockpit for pilots of an emergency I think that is um, and then we have the BA logo the first door the One World Alliance logo um, as they are part of uh, One World the British Airways the emblem I think it's the emblem then we have a landing light I'm not sure how well you can see that but that's a landing light go along to the engines the turbines do spin I just don't have anything to show that they do uh, uh, Royals Royce um, logo then the like serrated edges to make the aircraft a lot more quiet um, we go along got the navigation lights for the rest of the wing and going back we have the Royal Mail 
and then the registration, and then the tail and the um, exhaust, um, the, the APU unit, I'm not sure, um, I think that's what it is. Um, and so that's the model, super detailed, well done by, uh, by Gemini Jets obviously, extremely good model. Um, and that's why it's one of my favourites, it's just so well detailed. Um, then again, it's really hard between, uh, to choose between this one and this one here. It was very hard. Um, but yeah, uh, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, please remember to like and subscribe uh, for more content. Um, I do, I really do hope you enjoyed this video. Um, and thanks for watching. Bye.